Hello everybody, I'm trying to fix this C64 motherboard and I'm, uh, you see here, Twist 504C1 and 252311 revision A. I think I found this kind of unique motherboard here because uh, uh, there is something wrong with the schematics I, I, I've got for this motherboard. Schematics here say that from pin 8 of the X701 so will go to directly 21 of BIC BIC okay and from pin 6 it go to the ferrite bed and then go to pin 22 okay let's check this please because there is something wrong here and that is not showing in this uh, in this in this schematics I hope this not to move too much. Uh, okay. Let's see. I'm going to put some more light here. Okay, we have now. Pin eight says uh, it should be going to uh, uh, twenty one. Okay, pin 8 go to 21. Pin 6 should go to 22. Doesn't, doesn't make any noise. What's happening here? What's happening here? It, it, broken traces? No, not broken traces. It seems that we have a one, one round trip that goes from pin 6 to pins 1, 2, of this uh, 74 LA08 and go back to pin 21 here. I try to show you. It's a very strange thing, it's a strange thing that it's not on the schematics. It's not on the service manual. I, I have not been able to locate this in any uh, official schematics. Okay. So, let's start. Pin number 6. Pin number 6 goes to this contact here. Pin number 6, this go to contact here. From this contact here, we go to this contact here. This contact here goes to pin 1 and 2 of this chip. So we can say that pin 6 goes to pin number 1 and number 2 of this chip. Okay. Pin number 3 of this chip doesn't sound, doesn't beep. Pin number 3 of this chip goes to its, its own contact here. Okay, pin number goes pin number three to its its own contact. In whole contact go now to the left of these two contacts here. And from here we have two exits. The pin number twenty one here, print the number twenty one here. So we can say that pin, so, sorry, pin 22, 22. This is pin 22. Beeps and goes to contact number three of this chip. Pin 22, contact three of the chip. Pin six of the uh, 0701 to pin one and two of this chip doesn't go directly from 6 to 22 doesn't go directly doesn't go go here and when this uh, chip is powering out I suppose when uh, receiving the the 
dot clock signal, it should fire the, the AND gate or in, on pin 1 and 2 and retain for 3, 2, pin number 21. But not only there, but also to pin 3 here. I know I don't know if you are going to be able to see, uh, try to fit it on on the image. Okay, pin three here goes to pin number one, two, three, two, three four, five, seven of the uh, uh, expansion port. One, sorry, pin one and two of the of the. Logic gate goes to pin 6 of the expansion port that is the, the dot clock here. Is well, move too fast. It's quite strange. It's quite strange. I don't know. I don't know if this uh, logic gate, why is hang going between uh, pin 6 and pin 21? Why? Because the uh, schematic shows a direct connection. See, P66 goes directly to 22. 6 to 22. And I'm missing um, the, the numbers, sorry. I'm missing the numbers. If you are watching this video, I'm missing the numbers. P66 soul go to P22, does not go directly. Goes through this this one chip and that's what i wanted to show you that the, there is a motherboard that doesn't follow the uh, schematics any of the schematics i've been able to found and i'm i'm taking a closer look to the to the to, to this chip because there are as you can see we have here uh, these two extra pinpoint that I not able, have been able to find in another picture on the on the net of this motherboard. Okay, so I hope this uh, clear some 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 people that I I've I've been able I'm trying to contact regarding this and can explain what's happening. Thank you for watching.